Paul was uniquely equipped for the task of ministering to the Gentiles due to his background. He was not only a devout Jew, but also a well-educated Pharisee who was fluent in both Greek and Hebrew. His knowledge of Greek culture, philosophy, and language made him particularly effective in communicating the gospel to the Greco-Roman world, which consisted largely of Gentiles. A diaspora Jew, he was born in modern-day Turkey and had Roman citizenship, which opened doors of opportunity throughout the Roman world. Acts 22, 3, 25, 29, 28, 30. Paul's training as a Pharisee, Philippians 3, 5, allowed him access to synagogues everywhere. Highly educated, he was thoroughly trained in the Mosaic Law under Gamaliel, Acts 22, 3, and received a classical Roman education in Tarsus. He was able to argue his point from Jewish law, Galatians 4, 21 to 31, and illustrate it from Greek literature, Acts 17 and 28, Titus 1 to 12, or Corinthians 15, 33. During the early days of Christianity, there was tension within the early church about whether Gentile converts should be required to follow Jewish customs and laws, such as circumcision and dietary restrictions. This issue, known as the Gentile Question, was a challenge for the Christian community. Paul's mission played a crucial role in advocating for the inclusion of Gentile people in the Christian faith without imposing Jewish customs up and down. His teachings emphasized that faith in Christ was sufficient for salvation, irrespective of one's ethnicity or adherence to Jewish laws. Paul's extensive missionary journeys took him throughout the Eastern Mediterranean and into Europe. His travels brought the message of Christianity to many Gentile communities in cities such as Corinth, Ephesus, Philippi, and Rome. These missionary efforts expanded the reach of Christianity far beyond its Jewish roots. Paul was the apostle to the Gentiles by God's choice. The Lord Jesus declared that he had a specific mission for Paul. This man is my chosen instrument to carry my name before the Gentiles and their kings and before the people of Israel, Acts 9.15. God equips those he calls for a purpose, and the Apostle Paul is an outstanding example of that.